Hey everybody, welcome back to Art Ninja TX. Thanks for tuning in. If you guys have been here a while, you know I've been working on an anime wall for my studio. I painted a lot of original art of what I consider to be the anime classics. And finally on the main section of the anime wall, I'm down to one spot. Now in thinking of what to put in this spot, all I could think of was Never Ending Story, Labyrinth, Legend, all these movies that I absolutely loved as a kid that would suck me into that fantasy world that I didn't want to return from. I mean, what kid didn't want to go fight knights and go on adventures and ride Falcor? So basically, anything that had knights, dragons, elves, anything fantastical, I was in. But what anime would have all of these things that are occupying my mind right now? No other anime comes to mind other than Record of Lotus War. Record of Lotus War is complete with that beautiful 90s anime aesthetic and some seriously hard hitting art. And even though it might be dated by some that watch it now that didn't grow up watching it, it's still a wonderful look at the past and a look at a different way the anime was made. The elves were so iconic for this series and everyone I knew back then had a crush on them. I mean, look at them. Now I'm the paint dealer because I feel like she represents this series the best, she's the most iconic, but just so you guys know, I'm definitely, definitely more a Pyrrhotus type of guy. So let's get started. So let's start out by saying that having to choose between Dila and Pyrrhotus broke me. It just mentally exhausted me, physically, emotionally, like having to make a decision like that ought to be illegal. The only reason that Dila is being painted right now is because I was scared to cross that line into NSFW art. I know with Pyrrhotus, her suit is more revealing, everything like that. I'm a guy, I'm weak. I, it just, I know it would have gone down that route, so I didn't go that way. Now I have a bunch of friends that would love for me to do that. And someday possibly, but for right now, I can't have guests coming over to the house, my parents, family, you know. They always come in and check out the studio and see what the newest work is or what I'm currently working on and I don't know how they feel about walking into something like that. But I can tell you, I do want to dive into the fantasy like hardcore just because it reminds me of being a kid, like all that magic, all that freedom and as you get older, the one thing I've learned is that they slowly take it away from you. They peel it off you layer by layer. And painting is that one little bit of magic that I still have left. And as corny as that sounds, it's true. When I'm painting, I'm not in Earth. I'm not in Houston, Texas. I don't have to go to work no matter what they say. I'm on Lotos. I'm chilling with my future ex-wife, D-Lit. We're drinking margaritas. And she's asking me to paint her, and that's what I'm doing. It's the perfect getaway. You cannot get better than that, I'm telling you. And I'm so thankful that I have that. All your problems go away. All the stuff you have to deal with goes away. You put on some good tunes that take you to another place, the, the type of music that gives you goosebumps, and you just flow, and it's awesome. Now, I don't paint stuff that's trending, I don't paint stuff for clout. I mean, look at what I'm painting right now. I'm painting an elf from a 30-year-old anime that nobody remembers but me and maybe a handful of other people. But it doesn't matter. I'm painting it for me. I'm painting it because it's special to me. No matter what you do, there's always going to be somebody that hates what you do. No matter how perfect you think it is, there's somebody that does not like it. There's somebody that would not wipe their bum with your painting. And that's okay. If you know Record of Lotus War and you like what I've done, I'm grateful. If by some chance I introduce you to something and you fall in love with it in the future, that's even better. But I hope you at least enjoy my painting and we'll see you around for the next one. 